Right, the second race for Maydock today, race 32, is a one mile three handicap uh, for 0 to 85 horses. Three holes and up, one is Lion Star Alex Cherry, two Bush Sugar Steve C, three is Just Right Obi Wan, four is Seabird Martin Leadham, five is Cicero Craig Beckwith, six is Fantastical Steve C, seven is New Order Graham Clutterbuck, eight is Top Ten Obi Wan, nine Classical Mode Alex Cherry, and ten is Cloth of Silk for Darren French. So ten horses in this handicap. Yeah, at Haydock. Not much came from the back in the last race. Avalanche and Miracle Spring led most of the way. So it's Cicero who gets out well for Craig Beckwith and Cicero leads from Seabird and that one's outside. Top 10 and just right. The two Obi Wan horses now moving to the fore with a fantastical just behind that. Then comes Cloth of Soul for Darren French. Classic mode. Alex Cherry's horse is running wide. New Orders is on the inside of uh, Wish Sugars and at the back of the field we have Lion Star for Alex Cherry. So there's about 8 or 9 nets first to last and just right leads for Obi Wan from top 10 in second. Then we have Cicero. Fantastical just behind that for Steve C. Seabird about three lengths back for Martin Eden with those lilac and white stripes. Then comes uh, Darren French's Cloth of Silk is on the outside of Wish Sugars. On the rail is Graham Clutterbuck's New Order. Uh, they're followed by the two Alex Cherry horses in those distinctive orange sleeves and orange cap. That's Lion Star and Classic Mode. So they've got seven photos left to travel yet, Haydock. And just right, the leader for Obi Wan from Fantastical is moved up into second. Cicero and that one's inside. Then comes top ten for the Obi Wan. But four lengths back to Seabird for Martin Depp. He pushed along to try and prove his position. Then comes Cloth of Salt for Darren French. They're followed by Wish Sugars in between horses. On the road is New Order. And still the two Alex Joris and Terry horses look on from the rear. Lion Star, who's now gone past their mate, Classic Mode, who's the new trailer. So four in a line for the lead. Just right on the inside with Fantastical on the outside. In between horses, top ten and. Cicero, who's now poked his head in front, they're followed by uh, Seabird trying to move closer, switching wide to do so, and out wide be pushed along to improve his class of silk. The rest of them got to sprout wings to get there. It's Cicero in front from Fantastical and just right, and then on the inside is a uh, top 10 Seabird trying to run on with class of silk. It's Fantastical in front now for Steve C from just right on his inside. They've got three photos left to go. They are making progress on the back of the field now, and running on very strongly is Classic Mode and New Order. In front, they're starting to get really just right in front from Fantastical on the outside. Classic Mode is finishing strongly. Classic Mode is going to probably mow them all down if he keeps it on that channel. Classic Mode on the outside. Cicero on the inside. Yeah, comes Classic Mode for Alex Terry. Cicero on the inside. And it was between horses. Seabird. It's Cicero on the inside. But Classic Mode is finishing very strongly. And Classic Mode now takes it up and draws clear. Classic Mode draws clear from Cicero in second. Seabird was third. Then Fantastical. And also ran from the rear of the field was Line Star. A sustained finish from Alex Cherry's horse on the outside. Classic mode, mowed them all down, drew away in a convincing fashion and wins come to be about two lengths from Cicero for Craig Beckwith back in second. He was up with the pace most of the way. Seabird was mid-pack, managed to hold right on for third and behind it was fantastical for Steve C. Alex, the line star came from the back of the field, was outpaced for Alex Cherry but did run on to finish back in fifth place. So Alex Cherry gets first and fifth in the Bedford TV handicap.